Hello, and here is a Minecraft launcher for Linux. Did you know, like it, the official one does support it. Here's how to set it up. First, go to your browser, uh, search for Minecraft, what the heck, uh, Minecraft launcher. There you go. I, I, I didn't need to type in for Linux, but again, uh, you can just go here. And this is the page you should be looking at, which is like download for Windows, but we're looking for another version. So just press on here, go to see below. And in here, you can see there is a lot of version, which is, is Arc and Arc Base, so which one we want. Uh, but there's also servers and stuff. But now we want to arc so if i just press on this you can see there you go it takes us to the r repository and it's pretty straightforward to like download from r and i'll show you like the methods to do it the first way is just using yay or baru whichever one you prefer that makes the process a lot easier so let me just show you that you can do yay dash s and then always remember to type in the package base so the thing that is typed here or the name that is written before the dot git and after the slash so we want to do minecraft uh, launcher so if i just type that in uh, you can see it will automatically pick everything up so i'll just hit enter on off just keep all of them to default and it should start installing so there we go and there go. it is installed so if i just search for minecraft launcher you can see that it is it does have the official minecraft launcher now while this updates uh, let me show you how to do this if you don't have yay installed again make sure to check this video out if you don't have yay uh, so what do you have to do is let me just clear this out uh, you can see this link right here this one uh, make sure to just copy this so you can click on it it will copy this and and what you have to do is have git installed so you need to do sudo pacman dash s dash s git so you need to have git installed i mean this uh git so make sure to have git installed or in case you don't want to just do sy it will just update repository and then do git anyway after you have git you can do git clone uh control shift v so paste in the link and then hit enter and it will just clone that into your repository now after that do cd minecraft launcher and then in here all you have to do is just type in make pkg dash si <coughs> Uh, hitting enter on this will do the same thing it did with EA, but since I already installed it, I won't be doing that. But again, in case you want to manually install it, you can do it that way. But I would say uh, if you are constantly downloading from the or repository or AUR, just get the EA installer. It just makes life a lot easier. So let's just wait for this to kind of download and open up. But that's about it for this video. If you did find this video helpful, make sure to subscribe to the channel and leave a like. Uh, make sure to check out the shop and get yourself a desk mat or a t-shirt if you want it or just donate to the channel to help me support what I do, or to support me on what I do. And again, if you are not old enough or if you don't have your own credit card or if you don't have your own money, you don't have to do anything. Just watching these videos support me a lot. So thank you for watching. Uh, let me just, let's wait for this to finish and we can, I'll just show you how this looks on Linux. So there you go. As you can see, it does look the same as the Microsoft launcher. So you can just sign in with your account and go from there and make sure uh, if you are having troubles with the Java version, you can actually install Java with just a simple command with, let me just show you how it is look like so you can do sudo pacman dash ss which will allow you to search just search for open jdk and this will show you like you see open J jdk 21 this is the version 21 java so like the java 21 version then there is 21 and if you just type in open jdk this will download the java 24 so depending on what version you are playing now this is for again a bit of more advanced users maybe you are trying to make a server maybe you are trying to like build something on the java then you have to do this just download one of them and install it like previously and also uh, i think you can, you can set java version which is so if i just do java dash dash version you'll see uh, i don't have any java installed and this will just get java runtime and install the java package so now now if i do java dash dash version as you can see it does pick up the java 24 version so hope you enjoyed that video and if you do did like it leave a like on the video and make sure to subscribe to the channel and i'll see you guys in the next one bye